Hello everyone and welcome to another TDR Family Gaming video. This is Droid TDR and today we are continuing Jean's story quest right where we left off. Well, Swan was clearly agitated. Maybe it is an emergency after all. Let's go and see what this is all about, shall we? They're throwing some banquet in your honor, aren't they? Where'd she go? Oh my gosh, she vaporized. I want that skill. What is going on here? Enter the tavern. Da -da 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 -da. Look at the flags. Look at the food. That's one we cooked. And that's one we cooked. <gasps> da -da -da -da. Oh, what's all this? It's a thank you party for you. Ooh. A thank you party? I knew it. Jean, when we heard the news about your illness, we were all so worried about you. We can only imagine how much pressure you must be under nice. as Auntie Grandmaster. And you do so much work all over Mondstadt. True we enough. We thought that since you so rarely take any time off, we'd take this chance to throw you a party. <laughs> After okay. all, you'll never let us do this once you're back at work. <laughs> uh... Jean? I... Uh, huh? Is this Jean when she's... shy? I've never seen her like this. It's easy to forget that outside of work, Jean is just a normal person, like anyone else. I... True enough. This is just all such a surprise. Thank you, everyone. This really means so much to me. Yay. <laughs> well, it's nothing compared to the amount of work you do for all of us. Dang but... There are so many things I still need to do. After eating. <sighs> After not, eating. We wanted to make sure you could relax and enjoy yourself. So while you were away, we all pitched in and finished off your work for you. Excellent. Every last task. Including me. Really? Even the issue with the food deliveries? It was no different from what we see on patrol. A couple of hilly churls. Didn't take much to get rid of them. And the tax yeah. returns? I spent so much time doing library admin. A few right. more pieces of paper to deal with was really nothing to worry about. Well, what about Margaret's missing cat? Are you <laughs> kidding me? That rascally prince was apprehended by the brilliant honorary knight. Yay. And he also reclaimed my precious astral iron strings while he was at it. While Enough he was already. at it, huh? No okay, then. Thinking about work he today. saw through my disguise. Enjoy yourself while you've got the chance. It is my honor to work alongside you all. Praise be for the Animo Archon's guidance. Speaking Yay. of work, it must have been hard work to put all this together. Where did you find the time? <laughs> Actually, our friend here was the key organizer behind all of this. What? See all of this food and drink? Oh yeah. He not only that, but he cooked each one of these beautiful dishes he himself. You see through my disguise. So relax already. There's no need to be so modest. Of course, we also have Master Diluc to thank Yay, for the Yay, Diluc. Otherwise, we would be looking at quite an alarming bill right about now. <laughs> Despite my initial reluctance to sponsor a Knights of Favonius event in any way, I, like any other citizen of Mondstadt, owe Jean my gratitude for her hard work. Oh, uh, Master Diluc. All right, all right. Jean's supposed to be taking it easy. Stop crowding her. Agreed. Mm -hmm. Now, let the party begin. Yay. Party. Nice. Spirited, cheerful party Everyone is enjoyed by all. seems to be partying hard. Paimon thinks we should join in the fun. Let's go and mingle. I think so too, oh, but holy and smokes. Oh, she saw Jean go upstairs by herself. Let's make sure the woman of the hour doesn't get left out. All right. Well, let's actually let Jean stew for a little bit and let's go talk to all the other guests. Amber, what is going on? Oh, wow. Amber, what? you look like you're about to burst into tears. Whatever is the matter? Huh. Two things. One, this sweet madame. Oh, Two, oh she likes our food. Roast. Did you make them? She likes the food. Mm, I refuse to believe it. Where did you suddenly learn to cook so well? Oh, I I'm had going some, to finish eating you know. this, and then you're going to teach me everything you know. Don't you dare try and run off. Nope, not gonna um, run nom, off. Nom, 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 nom. 
ever <laughs> been drinking? No, she just loves our food. We have the magic touch, apparently. Anything else? Oh, wow. No, nope, no, nope. okay. You We're in a loop. Two things. Did you make them? You better believe uh, I did. Uh, I'm going to fit. Um, um, okay. Bye bye, Amber. Glad you like the food. What do we got here, Venti? Can we sit next to you, Venti? We're we're facing the wrong way, and we and we can't talk to Venti while we're sitting this way. But what the? Sit that way. Can we sit that way? N no. And we can't talk to Venti when we're sitting that way. Ah, what's going on? All right, jump on the food table. There you go. Jump over it. Now let's sit. There we go. All right, now we got them both. Ugh, Venti, what's up? Word. The Tawn Winery's wine is every bit as delectable as they say. Mm -hmm. I would never be able to afford this normally. So, in the spirit of enjoying the moment while it lasts, another glass for the bard, please. No, my, he's just can drink taking advantage of the free ah, hello. food, isn't he? I didn't see you there. I blame the wine for monopolizing my attention. Much like my balance, it deserves to be enjoyed for generations to come. Hmm. What is this floating sensation I feel? Have I discovered the true meaning of animal power? Uh, Venti, I think you've had a little bit. Talking. Yeah, you've had I a little bit. I hereby declare that every son and daughter of the city of the wind must be compelled to taste this finest of wines. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least he's a silly drunk. What's up, Deluke? Can we can we talk to him? Where we are, or do we have to sit down and and then talk? To him? We have to sit and That's talk. That's class number thirty-seven. What's Deluke doing? Mm. I'm keeping count of this bard's alarming piece of progress smokes. through my wine. I don't think you can Only physically the do that. Only for free tonight. It seems he didn't get the message. Oh. When he sobers up, I will present him with the bill. Uh -huh. Duke, you're a meanie. Uh -huh. I'm joking, of course. Oh. I highly doubt he could afford it anyway, so I shall spare him the bill. But I must wow. say, the sheer volume of alcohol this fellow can put back is just not normal. Indeed. Indeed, he's venti. All right, what's up with Kaya? Kaya, are you scheming? Let's sit down and have a chat. No more Having treasures. No more fake treasures and pirate stories to is, tell us. Jean knows all of us so well now. Mm -hmm. When someone organizes a surprise party for you, the closer you are to them, the more bashful you tend to feel about the whole thing. True. So instead, we just gave you all the credit. Huh. After all, you did do more than your fair share of the work anyway. Yes, I did. Of course! This party was clearly Kaya's idea. Shy Kaya? This is gold. Nice job, Kaya. <laughs> you think so? Uh, probably. So you admit it! <laughs> I'm only indulging you since it's such a special day today. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's what Kaya's got to say about it all. I wish you could eat the food. Alright, what's up with, uh... Barbara and Lisa. <sighs> this is quite a lot of excitement considering the idea was to relax and take it easy. <laughs> Would a drink help you relax? Uh, is there anything without alcohol? What do you normally drink? Oh, you know, I normally mix a few things together, but I always add some bright red. Red? Red. Let me guess. Tomatoes. No, watermelon! Uh. <laughs> Chilies. I add chili peppers. Oh my gosh. Chili pepper? In a drink? Zoiks. Alright, what's uh, what's Lisa got to say about this whole fiesta? Let's get close. Leaving the hustle and bustle of the banquet behind them, the two of them stood there, huh. together, in the quiet of the night, while the rest of the world melted away around them. What? That sounds like the sort of thing you'd find in a romantic novel, no? Uh, I'm not trying to get you to recite poetry to me or anything. You're not. I'm just saying. Jean went upstairs to the balcony. Alone. Now's your chance. <laughs> For what? You are a tease, Lisa. Alright. So let's go find Jean. 
Uh, she went upstairs to the balcony. Up, up, upstairs. Maybe it's maybe it's the door off to the side. That's probably where I went. Yes. Let's try this one. And there she is. Oh, it is you. It is I. There you are. <laughs> are you yes, having a good time? I am just getting some air. Oh, good. Uncle, it seems like something's bothering Jean. Oh, no. I want to thank you again. Okay. Actually, I had nothing to do with any of this. Are you looking more up? Either upbeat? way, yeah. it is good to be here together with everyone. It has lifted my spirits. Yay. And it has taught me something. What did What's it teach that? you? Is there a moral here? I am definitely more of a dandelion knight than a lion fang knight. Okay, then. The lion fang knight represents Vanessa's past, a past in which she fought hard for Mondstadt. But it was the dandelion knight that represented her hopes for the future. Uh -huh. A future belonging to the newly formed knights of Favonius. Good, good, good. All good. I do She'd believe be that proud Vanessa of you. watches over us, whether from high up above or from the wind all around us. Let the wind lead. Let the wind lead. The winds of freedom will guide us along the path that lies ahead. <laughs> I hope you will continue to join us on that path. Sure will. Till I'm top of the table here, buddy. Hey, Master's Day off. We got Jean's Act 1 complete. Brilliant. Look at that. Oh, 60 primos. Very nice. Very nice. Look at that. I can run back and forth and find a spot here. I think this is where we're going to pause for today. So uh, thank you all for watching. We will see you in the next one. Until then, what will we do? I don't know. We'll go find our quests to see what we got coming up. Look at all these quests we can do. Any Archon things? So many things. Look, we can almost open Venti's story quest and then followed that by Mona and then Zhongli. And then there are all these things too. Hangouts? Not fully sure what they do, but looks like, um, you know, we can hang out with a character and learn a little more about him or something. So, got a few things to do before unlocking those, I guess. But there you go. There you go. Looks like we got some Archon quests. We got uh, some other things we can do. So, again, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.